In an interview with the House Oversight and Reform Committee to discuss the Trump administration's security clearance process, White House Personnel Security Office employee Trisha Newbold officially blew the whistle on the Trump White House, alleging that it notoriously overrode national security professionals and granted security clearance to a number of disqualified people in the administration. As Politico reports, Newbold kept a list of White House officials whose clearance applications were initially denied but eventually overruled. The list is said to include as many as 25 people that had daily access to the president. According to Ms. Newbold, these individuals had a wide range of serious disqualifying issues involving foreign influence, conflicts of interest, concerning personal conduct, financial problems, drug use, and criminal conduct, aides wrote in summary of Newbold's testimony. Newbold told lawmakers that she felt it was necessary to come forward with this information because when she tried to voice her concerns internally, they were completely disregarded. I do not see a way forward positively in our office without coming to an external entity, and that's because I have raised my concerns throughout the executive office of the president to career staffers as well as political staffers, she said. And I want it known that this is a systematic, it's an office issue, and we're not a political office, but these decisions were being continuously overrode.